Hello everybody. Welcome to a beautiful morning. October here, Mediterranean coastline. Nice, warm, sunny mornings. Welcome to Highfield Boats TV. Look at this behind me here. Look at this. A very specially built Patrol 760. Built for a special customer of ours down here on the Adriatic, one of our best ambassadors, Samo Jurenko. Come on board with me. We'll run through some of the features of this boat. You'll get a better idea of just how amazingly versatile the Patrol 760 is. So, welcome aboard. Welcome aboard this uh, special Patrol 760 that we've built for one of our best ambassadors, Samo Jurenko. Now, Samo has worked with us for a few years. We we initially supplied him with a Patrol 660, which you will have seen in some of our content videos. This year, it was time for us to change that boat for him. So we worked with Samo, as we do with all of our key ambassadors, and we asked him for some design changes, for some needs that would improve his experience um, on the water. You know, we need to congratulate Samo right now because recently in a competition in Turkey, he, he placed third in the world uh, for free diving and we really should salute that achievement and really, really good work from Samo. So the first thing you can see is he's added a hard top. He's added our new XL hard top, which gives him security, which gives him shelter, which keeps him out the worst of the sun, which keeps him out the worst of the rain. So we're going to walk through this boat. I'm going to show you some of the bits and pieces uh, to give you an idea of this really excellently modified Patrol 760. First of all, you can see the roof rack. Now, the roof rack for when Samo is off for long periods of time can really carry an awful lot of the kit that he needs. You can see there, beautiful strap down points, perfect place for a paddleboard, perfect place for any equipment that he needs to travel with. If he put, wants to put a tent up there for when he's staying off on a particular dive site, it's perfect. It's perfect for carrying that weight. It's weight bearing. You know, you can put, you can put a lot of weight up there, no problem at all. Now, let's go aft. First thing again, look at the deck. Because Samo will be working with heavy weights, be working with lead weights, We've protected the deck, so the deck has strong rubber matting all the way through this boat to keep it as well protected as possible so that when he does drop the weights back in the boat, there's not gonna be any damage. Look at this amazing storage area. You can see an access hatch in there for the battery switch and the really important wiring. Beautiful storage compartment in there, it really is. It's a huge area. Really nice extra feature on this XL hardtop. Weatherproof, got reversed, reversed seals on there. So that will keep the worst of the weather out. Really nice screen, visibility is amazing on this boat. Really, really good viz. I mean, you can, if you wish, as you've seen on some of our boats, add canvas sides here to drop down to protect you even further. But Samo has not decided that that's something he requires. Look at this, when you're under navigation, look. Look at these handholds. I know it's small details, but it's the small details that make a difference. That's a really nice place. If you're standing behind the driver when this boat is underway, look at how secure you are. You, you really are. It's a superb place to be. Really functional, beautiful commercial console. Everything is there. Everything is visible. Everything you need. No frills, nothing you don't need. We don't need that for this boat. Hydraulic steering quite clearly, nice footrest, battery switching down here. You can see this only needs one seat. So we have a driver and a passenger, flip up, drop down, bolster position. Depending on the sea conditions, you can ride on your knees or you can sit down on those calmer days. Samo has asked us to create some storage pockets for him. So we've built this wraparound storage compartment so he can store his fins in here, he can store his dive kit in here, he can store his goggles in here, he can keep all of those things away from the deck, nice and tidy, so he knows where they are when he needs them. Again, look at the deck, look, look at the deck. All the way throughout this boat, all the way throughout this boat, rubber decking, really, really beautifully protected. Extension posts here again, good handholds, good height, really, really coming back to the aft bench. As you know, with all of our patrols, the aft bench 
is absolutely huge. Really massive storage area in there. It's absolutely enormous. Beautiful for a boat of this size. It's class leading that rear bench. Self-draining at rest, as you can see. Deck scuppers are out, so she's fully self-draining should she ship any rain or water on board. This one is powered by the ultra-reliable, ultra-refined Honda 250 V6. Beautifully quiet, beautifully economical, really smooth power delivery. It will propel this boat up to around 42 knots. Again, for Samo's use, he's going to be sitting at 25 knots most of the time, so he needs economy, he needs reliability, and that is exactly what you get with a Honda. You can see here that we've modified the roll bar for him. So this is where Samo will be keeping his spear guns for when he goes spear fishing. So we have spear gun attachment points here, and then you have a bar dedicated in the base of the roll bar so that his guns will sit this side of that bar, which means that they don't slide around or get in the way of any of the motor. It also crucially keeps them out of the boat, keeps them off the deck, keeps them away from anybody else on this boat that could potentially injure themselves or cause a bit of an issue. As you would expect, specific dive ladder for Samo. Massive over-engineered ladder. You can see there, that ladder will drop right down on the port side of this boat. And it's a beautiful place to reboard from, especially when he's just been on a long dive, fins off, straight on that ladder. Nice rubber padding. Nice rubber padding here for your feet. Nice and comfortable. Non-skid deck area. It really is a perfect, perfect boat for Samo. Look at the space. The space on board is really, really amazing. He wanted a little bit more room. He wanted a bit more ease to get around with his kit and his students. And I think when you look at this Patrol 6 760, it really does give that. I mean, it's a very spacious, very capable boat. Remember, it sits on our 26 degree dead rise offshore all weather hull. We've used this hull, remember, to build lifeboats. You know, so this is ultra safe, ultra stable ultra strong you have all the strength of aluminium built into this boat you have a 250 litre fuel tank you have self-draining deck you have an enormous number of modifications that you can you can ask your local dealer to, to help you with twin engine single engine this boat really is a wonderful wonderful platform whether it be for leisure use commercial use semi-commercial use the 760 is a brilliant brilliant all-rounder